This is the anatomy of the paediatric hip in a coronal mid-sagittal plane. We can see the transducer is initially quite anterior and not mid-sagittal. The ilium is sloped but then progressively becomes horizontal and parallel with the transducer as the probe is in the mid-sagittal plane. With slightly more pressure on the lower end of the transducer, the bony roof line is now more reflective. We can see the femoral head to the right of screen. So the anatomy that must be understood in order to perform graph angles is the ilium and the bony rim. The bony rim is where we see convexity transition to concavity. That hypoechoic structure is triradiate cartilage. This echogenic triangle is the labrum. This is the cartilaginous roof, which along with the joint capsule helps to stabilise the femoral head within the socket more laterally. So the greater trochanter is also seen here with the synovial fold, which is slightly echogenic, then the gluteus minimus, the medius, and the overlying soft tissues. This is the pubis on the medial wall of the acetabulum.